Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here. And it is day five here on Planet 26. And so the last episode, we finished up getting the iron pipeline over to here. And everything's working. Uh, we've got iron coming in. Uh, we've got power to it. And let me, just, let me grab some more. And uh, so I think today what I'm going to have to do is go find some more resources because I don't want to mine gravel. I'm trying to stay away from doing that. And I, uh, uh, so I need to find silicon and nickel. So well, I think what we're going to do According to the map, it's a little ways away, but according to the map, uh, let me get out of here. I think there's silicon off over in this direction. There's nickel and silicon. Now the trick is I've got to figure out what I got in the way of mountains and stuff, but looking at the, the map, I should be able to get over into uh, that area and what I'm going to do is set up some resource nodes. They're quite a ways away. I'm probably not going to build pipelines. I just want to get the resource nodes in and be able to uh, gather up uh, some uh, nickel and some silicon and bring that back so that I can uh, start uh, really kind of getting the base set up. And then at some point we will put in a pipeline coming in from that area over there. Uh, it'll be a little bit of a jaunt. And then I think somewhere along the way going over there, there should be some uh, gold or silver, or silver actually I think is what it probably is. So I am going to hop in the planet rover and uh, start heading over in that direction and once I get uh, part way over there I'll, uh, I'll give you an update as I am traveling along so I'll catch up with you here in just a little bit well I have been kind of traversing around here I see over there in the distance uh, a river which is what I was trying to find I think I'm hoping that's the river that I was looking for and uh, so I'm going to get over to it uh, it's been a little bit of a challenge driving through these uh, forests but I'll give you a little taste of what I've been dealing with here trying to get through we're gonna take out take out these couple of trees and then see if I can't maneuver through here. Uh, let's head over this direction. And we'll get over here on the ice. That will be a lot easier to traverse. So let's head up this way. I'm thinking that it might be this way. I don't know. I'm trying to. It's going to be a lot easier to drive, at least on the ice, that's for sure. So we're going to head this way. Uh, I'm hoping that we're on to the right one. Now we should be coming either to the end of the, the ice lake or the river, or we should be hitting a junction. So, just wanted to kind of give you a little bit of an update on where I was at and uh, what we were finding. You can see I've got the uh, ore detector on, and so I'm looking for hitting some, uh, I believe, silver, and then if we can find the right channel. Oh, silver. All right. 
How nice. All right. Well, that means I should be... Let's park this right here. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. So we got those mountains over there. And... If I'm looking at that correctly... Let's swing around here. We've got this string of mountains along here. Alright. Well, we're going to... going to mark uh, mark this silver let me get over a little closer to it yeah we'll do it somewhere about right here it looks like well Yeah, it's good enough right here. So let me park this. All right, let's hop into our GPS. Uh, new from current. Silver field. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to keep uh, pursuing along, and hopefully I am going to find uh, where I need to kind of pull off. I think I need to get around these mountains on my left right here and swing around, and hopefully we'll find some nickel and uh, silicon. So once I uh, get a little closer to that area over there, I will uh, catch back up with you all. Alright, well, I haven't found the nickel or the silicon yet, but I've run across the one uh, uranium deposit, and so I'm just trying to zero in on it. As you can see, we've got uh, enemies all around us. We've got uh, patrol drones, uh, more ore processing plants so I think what we want to do is mark this and see if we can't set up a uh, resource node see if it'll work and then uh, uh, start harvesting some uranium because we can actually use that this uh, has a, a reactor on it so if I could get some uranium that'll be good uh, that'll make sure that we have plenty of power. So let's see if we can kind of zero in on this. Just come back. Just see how... How deep it really is. I'm hoping that uh, the resource nodes will be able to mine it. I, I don't know. Yeah, it looks like we've got some weather coming in, of course. Uh, let's do this. Let's park this. And, uh, let's go back inside. Now, I don't know. I have an elite. Let's open this. Close that. Yeah, I didn't think this was going to pick it up. Well, looks like we're going to be here a little while. Let's, uh, let's hop back inside.
I should have when I was over there on the frozen river. Picked up some more ice. That was uh, not thinking on my part. Uh, well, let's just kind of look and see what we got in the way of ice. So we still got uh, that there. Okay. Uh... All right. It's getting farther away. I might have to drill down to it, I'm guessing. Well, let's uh, park it. Let's uh, see if we can uh, get a resource node built. As I uh, get that farther along, I'll uh, catch back up with you here in a little bit. All right, well, I have managed to find the uranium. It's pretty deep. Uh, I don't think my resource nodes are going to work on it because it's so deep. Let's put that in there. I'll show you how deep it actually is. We'll go down in the hole down here. We at least got ice. I actually, you know what, I should turn this thing on and collect some more ice while we're here. Uh, do this. Control panel. Just turn it on. Oh, it doesn't have enough power, I don't think. Uh, let's see. Oil panel. Static drill. Yeah, 648. And so I need to put two of those up there. Alright, let's turn the block off. Uh, let's go ahead and get another turbine up there. I think I should be able to get it on there. Uh, let's see, what do I got in inventory? Okay, I do have some steel plates. Let's get this up. Let's go grab the parts for it. This is uh, turning out to be a bit more of a challenge day than I was expecting. All right, there's all of our turbines, parts. And let's see if we can get up here. I'm going to have to rethink how I am going to do... Alright. Can we get this thing to stick? There we go. Alright, can I reach it? Let's see if that's enough power. All right. Static drill. Turn that on. It is. I don't know if I'll leave this here or not, but at least wise it can gather up some ice for us while we're here. And all right, so here's how deep I had to go for the uranium, which is good. This is actually, you know, it may not have been what I wanted, but I did am going to end up getting stone and uranium, so that'll give me some silicon and nickel anyway. Although I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to end up with all of that gravel, but eh, it is what it is. I might have to just deal with that. And maybe I'll find a use for that gravel somewhere along the way. But you can see I came a long ways down here and finally somewhere about right here uh, is where I started yeah, hitting the uranium. And so we'll get down and into here 
and we're into the uranium so let me uh, go ahead and do some more drilling here well I'll get a load of uh, uranium let's go do this I'll show you what I've got to go through here to get it and this is with the elite well uh, drill so it's not filling up very fast but this should be enough for now uh, so that I can get plenty of uranium to run the mobile factory. You know, it's got the solar panel and it's got uh, uh, it's got the power, you know, the solar panels and the batteries, but this uh, uranium power plant will really help a lot. Huh. Uh, I didn't drop any along the way, have I? I guess I probably don't have to go too much deeper. So let's just start uh, fanning this out a little bit. trying to hope to avoid have to do some full. hand drilling uh, but I guess that's just all part of it we're gonna have to deal with that let's get up and out of here and we'll get this into the refinery get it going I'm sure I got some stone out of that uh, and if not, well, I guess I'm going to just mine a little bit of stone just to make sure I have nickel and and uh, silicon so that we can uh, make our way back to the base. And if uh, for for now, I might end up just setting up a stone place to to cover the that kind of uh, materials that I need. So let's get this in here. And let's see what our how our refinery's doing. Oh, I didn't get any stone. Let's bump this up. And let's drop this into there. And So we need the oxygen. What we really need the ice for is for this here, so that when we have a storm, uh, this remains uh, airtight, so that it stays warm and we have plenty of oxygen in here. Uh, let's see how much we've gathered. We'll let that keep working away. Oh yeah, there we go. Let's grab that. And then we can probably turn this off for now. Uh, let's turn that off. Let's go ahead and grab this little bit. I'll probably I'll leave that there. This will be a good good way to find this place. Uh, I'll take all that extra steel out of there on my ramp going up. And. Uh, so every time we come over here to get uranium, we can always get some ice while we're at it. Alright, let's uh, throw this in here. Uh, there we go. Yeah, that'll give us plenty of ice for now. And let me go grab some stone while we're at it. Let's get down and in here. And maybe we'll just do a little bit of a offshoot out this way.
Inventory full. Well, it didn't take much to... Alright. I can still walk down here. And I can still get back up and out of here. Alright. Well, we'll get this stone in there and we'll grab another bit of stone. We'll mark this. And, uh, yeah. Alright, I'll tell you what. I'll uh, catch back up with you here in just a little bit once I finish getting this, getting some stone in there, getting some more resources built up. We'll uh, get back over, and we'll, and then uh, when I'm getting ready to head back over to the respawn pod, which is over that away, uh, I will uh, catch back up with you all. Okay, well, I have uh, managed to find the uranium. Uh, let me... Uh, one thing I need to do while I'm right here is uh, take a screenshot. Uh, let me do this. There we go. All right. Yeah, it's not going to be a very exciting screenshot, but it'll work. Okay, there we go. Let's uh, do this. All right. Well, it's time to start making our way back. Uh, let's see if we can get back to the respawn pod. Uh, I think what I'm going to end up doing is throwing a resource node down over by the base and let it mine stone for me. And in that way, then I'm not going to worry about right at the moment uh, going and finding silicon and uh, nickel. Uh, I probably will be able to get enough from the stone. And then uh, I'll, uh, I'm going to uh, get the base set up and then I'll find a use for that gravel. Uh, might put in a gravel sifter, which will uh, refine that down some more. And then uh, we'll kind of go from there. So, let's see here. It's time to start heading back. Uh, and what is going to be the safest way? Uh, let's see if we can get in over here. Maybe up through here. I think maybe this valley will kind of head up. And I didn't realize those big white patches were actually ice. So I might be able to put in a, uh, if I need more ice, I can put something in over there. But I think if we could kind of swing up through here, hopefully this will help us kind of avoid All right, a little wheelie action there. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think hopefully we can start heading back through here. All right, well, I will uh, catch back up with you all once I get back to uh, where we're going to put the base in. And I'll uh, see you in a little bit. All right, I made it back to where uh, the future base, I keep caught wanting to call it the base, but this is where ultimately it's going to get built. And I think what I have decided on is I'm going to throw a resource node in right over here for stone. Uh, it should just bind stone right over here. That way I'm not having to sit there and can drill a bunch of stone and then uh, uh, I can grab it as I need it. So I think uh, I think I'll do that in the next episode, and uh, we'll start getting that set up. The next real important uh, 
ore that we need to find, I think, is magnesium. And that's a little ways off, so I'm not sure how I'm going to go about doing that. Uh, that's going to be a bit of a challenge to get to it, I think. Uh, so we'll see. Uh, there may be another patch, but uh, it's going to be kind of a challenge to get there. All right. Uh, so let's get back over here. And I think, so I think the next thing will be to start getting that, uh, I'll get that resource node set up over there and it can start mining stone for us. Uh, and then I think I need to start kind of working on setting up a plan for power since we have uranium now. Uh, that kind of opens up a lot more options for us. Uh, I still plan on wanting to put in a wind farm. Uh, and that's basically what I'll start with and then we'll also set up a, a solar panel solar array uh, which uh, will help supply uh, power and then uh, we will uh, maybe put in some uh, reactors a couple of small reactors but that's a little ways off yet so uh, but I think uh, next episode resource node and uh, start working on power all right all you space engineers out there uh, keep building away. Keep your heads low. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps the video out a lot. And uh, please subscribe. That really helps the channel out a lot. Okay, keep building away out there. Keep your heads low. Don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.